Hiring is tough. And there's not a fail-safe method. There are hundreds of thousands of companies out there who tout that they have the assessment, the resource, the tools to bring you just the best candidates. Have you ever tried to use them? Sure, there are assessments and things that bring that risk factor down, but at the end of the day, people are human. And there's a lot of elements that go into the psychology and makeup of who they are. Here are some golden rules that either if you hire or you're responsible to teach others how to hire will serve you in a great way. People typically are attracted to an opportunity, a role within a company, for one of three reasons. They see it as either a job, a career, or a calling. If your way of getting applicants is through uh, sifting resumes and then scheduling interviews, there are ways you can ask questions to decide how it was that this actual candidate became attracted to wanting to apply. Now first, you have to make sure that they're comfortable enough to be open and honest. There are certainly people that are professional interviewers. It can be hard to catch them. So allow them to first feel safe in the space during the interview process, that it's not going to be a typical interview. Ask questions that allow them the opportunity to explore more of a bigger picture for themselves. And then ask, what drew them to apply for this role? The candor that you should get or the transparency that you should be able to convey from their body language will help you answer that question. Job, career, or calling? Now, if you have an urgent immediate need and you're not necessarily looking for the long-term employee, sure, somebody who's answering a call for a job could be a good fit. Where most hiring managers go wrong, who are then responsible to train and develop them, is we all have that sort of um, gladiator thing about us where we believe we can hire somebody and we can help teach them and train them to get them where we think they need to be. I see that special spark in them and I can help them develop that into being something more than what they're bringing to the table currently. We all do it. So be aware of it so you can help cut back on those hiring decisions that aren't the best fit. Here's what happens when you hire somebody with the expectation of them being there long term. And what brought them to you was that it was a job. You dilute your culture, you take your employee engagement down, and ultimately you just set your standard here. Are you looking to grow your company or are you looking to stay where you are or go backward? The choices you make hiring will help determine the direction you're going to go. Now the other two I mentioned, career and calling. People love the opportunity to grow and develop and for some in their mindset that has to do with roles and responsibilities. I certainly got into the industry I was in because of the career opportunity. As I grew and developed, I found that was really connected to my calling. Now, if you are lucky enough to get those uh, candidates that come to you because of the calling, and you can actually sift through and find out if their calling aligns with the culture and direction of your company, you could have just landed yourself an incredible new team member. And lastly, if you hire or you teach others to hire, here's a second golden rule that will help in a great way. Only hire people who are better than you. This is something most people don't do. We look at them as an opportunity of protege, protege and mentor, and then we hire with that gladiator mindset that we can get them where we want them to be. But if you could teach them to hire people who are better than them, who bring skill sets above and beyond what they already possess, what could happen to the strength of your team? I hope this was a helpful conversation. It's a little longer, I realize that but the relevance and significance of the people you hire have such a short-term and long-term impact on your business. You wanna take a look at your practices and set some golden rules for hiring. Have a great day.